Welcome back everybody. We have a new video today and we went to a baseball card store in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. A place we had been to before, but it had been remarkably 20 years between visits. Two, zero, 20 years. The same guy was still there. He now owns the shop. And he asked me, hey, you ever been here before? And I said, yeah, believe it or not, 20 years ago. He said, 20 years? Well, don't make it 20 years before your next, between your next visits. And I said, I think I'll be back sooner than that. Got some top loaders for all these tall boys I've been getting. TTM, 25 holders. These are kind of expensive. $6 for 25 times two. And then uh, one pack of sleeves. Obviously, take care of that. There's 100 sleeves in here. $3. So that'll take house of some of my tall boys that I've been purchasing. And these cards were in a loose bin, a quarter a piece, I think they ended up being. I got 65 or, I don't know, 66, something like that. And okay, these cards were a member of that too, so I will look through those. All guys who signed through the mail, 73 through 78, probably something like that. Tom House, Johnny Grubb, Steve Busby. Bob Montgomery, some of these guys we just got back recently. Uh, Griffey Jr., there's the two Griffs, two quarters. Merv Redmond, Pete Broberg, Laren Lagro, Steve Royers. So all these guys signed through the mail. Uh, D'Aquisto, and Bob Apodec has been known to sign through the mail a little bit. D'Aquisto definitely does. Bill Fahey, Burt Campanaris, look at that, 72 tops. Really good condition on that. He'll sign three for ten. Uh, Randy Jones. Haven't had much luck with Randy Jones. That got two fails on him. Tom Murphy. We just saw a couple of people get him back this week after long journeys. Uh, Chris and Chris Cards and uh, Johnny Serena. Jim Lomberg, Mike Caldwell, Steve Bry again. Jim Tommy. Look at that. Is that a rookie card for a quarter on a stadium club? I think it is. Brent Strom again. Haven't sent to him in my life. Don Money. He's a money man. Brent Strom again. Uh, Tommy, Hutton, Tommy Hutton. Tom Bradley lives right here in town. Roy Face on the 60 series. you got to be kidding me. Bob Montgomery again. Larry Garrett. This is signed, ladies and gents. Looks like he did it in ballpoint. Didn't turn out. Then did it better ballpoint. So we've got two Larry Garrett autographs on the same card for a buck. I mean, for a quarter. Dwayne Kuyper's rookie card. We just got him back recently through the mail. That's his rookie card. Long-time announcer Bergmeier. We're going to send to him. Tom Murphy again. Red Hot Ed Hot. The Blade. Tom Hall on the 75. Johnny Grubb again. Dave Gold's rookie card, 73. Barry Bunnell. Kevin Coble. He's on that uh, uh, 75 rookie pitchers. Bill Stein. Doug Rao. Buzz. Murph. Bro Hammer. Bro Hammer. Don Money again. Billy Gabarkowitz. There's the Aquisto's second year card. Bro Hammer. Tommy Hutton again. Bergmeier again. Fred Kendall. Hey, Mark Bruner. Is that his rookie card? Yes. Danny Bugs. That's his rookie card from WVU. And Larry Cole's rookie card. <laughs> Take it all day long. Herbert Scott. It might be his rookie. Felix Mion early in his career. Oh, this was in a uh, dollar because the Braves are big there because the uh, Myrtle Beach Pelicans single A team is a Braves affiliate. So that was actually a dollar. And these, again, were in a special pile, but they were a quarter apiece. We just got Larry Seipel back uh, last week and Vern Den Herter rookie card for a quarter. Yes, please. All right. This Clemente was a, in the dollar pile. All these Clemente, that was a dollar. Now we're back to the quarters. Quarter, 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 quarter. Send those to Linda Ruth Tossetti. That'll look really good signed. These were a quarter, regardless of what they're marked. Unless they were less than a quarter, then they were as marked. So quarter, quarter, we're going to send to both these fellas. Bob Johnson was 19 cents. Boone was a quarter. Renko was a quarter. Chuck Asijan, quarter. There's the blade again. Two more of him. Mark Lewis from Cincy, Hamilton, Ohio. Now, this is interesting. Half price on the uh, these cards. Dennis Eckersley, rookie. We just got this back through the mail. Just got this back slabbed. Now we're going to start again. And that's in pretty decent condition for an Eck rookie. 
for five bucks. <laughs> yes, I'll do that. Joe J on the second year card, buck seventy nine, half price. So I got that for uh, ninety cents. Not in the greatest condition. Has a little crease, double crease down here, vertical. Don't know if you can see that in the light or not. Jackie Smith, four dollars. Yes, yes, yes. We just got this back through the mail as well. Wait a bit. Send to him. No, he has a fee. Five dollars. Won't hesitate to send him. Boomer's rookie again. We love this card. We've got one out with Boomer now. Uh, got that for five bucks. Tony Larusa rookie card. Just got this back slabbed. We'll take that for seven fifty all day long. Clemente, uh, what year is this? Seventy three D. Got a little, well, not a little crease. A crease through the middle of the card there, but for three fifty, we'll take it. Dennis Martinez autograph card for $1.50. <laughs> Take it. Kevin McReynolds for a dollar on a rookie card, and he charges 10 through the mail. <sighs> Dallas Green, deceased, 250. Great manager. Uh, Roy Girella rookie card for $1.50. Yes, please. He's charging through the mail. And this is uh, Daryl Ward. For a dollar. Got Ortiz rookie card and Richie Sexton. Take that just for the Ortiz. Uh, Harry Carson rookie card, three dollars. Yes. Just got that back slab. Bought it through from Card Cutter last week. And finally, I got this card. We just got him back through the mail. I was asking people how to not get him to personalize. For ten dollars, this card's in a really decent condition. 67 Philadelphia. You commonly see these off center. Hamburger rookie card is expensive anyway but to get that for 10 i thought let's do it i'm going to send him a feed i'm going to send him a note asking him to not personalize and we'll see what happens but i've definitely been looking for this card for years and years hoping not to get it personalized he's been hesitant to send or hesitant to pull the trigger on that because he just personalizes almost just about at 100 of what he sends so that's it what do you think boom dennis eck send him out Get some ink on that. What'd you think? Baseball card. It's called Baseball 17 in Surfside Beach, South Carolina, right next to Myrtle Beach. Check it out for yourself if you're in that town, vacationing. Great store. All sorts of stuff everywhere you look. I was trying to get some video in there, but just didn't turn out. So would love to show you the store. Great size. Great supplies. I also bought some... Um, Two uh, slabbed shoe boxes, two row boxes, and then two three row boxes to put all my uh, TTMs in for storage. So he has all sorts of storage, including the top loaders that you see there. Thanks anyway. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Click subscribe to my channel by clicking right there. And then uh, hit that bell or ring all and you'll be notified of any future video that I post, whether it be a card shop battle or video. Breaking packs, whatever it is, TTMs three times, two times a week. Check it out for yourself. And if you missed last Wednesday's video, I'll leave a link to that right there. Thanks for being with me today, and we will see you soon, everybody.